Even on Hilton Head, even the best planned sunny beach vacations don't always work out the way they're supposed to. And that's when it's really good to know about places like the Hilton Head Resort, one of Hilton Head's top economy condos near the beach. Just in case the weather doesn't cooperate with your sunny vacation plans, Hilton Head Resort wants you to have a great vacation on less sunny days too. It's probably one you've seen before. It's probably the one you saw on that vacation rental by owner site. It's been around since the 80s and it's still one of Hilton Head's most popular economy condos for short-term rentals. I'm Chris Harrow with Keller Williams Realty. We're giving you a quick tour around today along with an overview and some pros and cons about the Hilton Head Resort. The Hilton Head Resort has more indoor amenities than most local condo complexes. It is also one of the only private condo complexes on Hilton Head where you can put your toes in the sand at an oceanfront bar right on site. And the Hilton Head Resort usually has some of the lowest oceanfront rental rates on the island. Whether you're looking for a full-time beach place or an investment property for short-term vacation rental income, Hilton Head Resort hits the sweet spot with location, amenities, and value that so many vacationers are looking for in their Hilton Head Beach vacation. On site, you have two outdoor pools, an indoor heated pool, hot tub, six lighted tennis courts, a fitness room, an indoor jogging track, and boardwalk to the beach, elevators in every building, laundry rooms near the elevators, lots of parking, and an on-site management office right out front. So those are some of the pros. Some of the cons to keep in mind, uh, no pets or animals allowed, except for seagulls and dolphins no RVs and trailers, and there is a longish walk to the beach. It's over a beautiful boardwalk, there's a seasonal shuttle, and there are even little benches along the way to rest and take in the views. To preview your walk to the beach, just check out our other video. Hilton Head Resort opened in the early 80s. There are over 460 condos in here. 44 of those are three bedrooms, and all the rest are two bedroom flats from about 830 to just under a thousand square feet. To get the lay of the land at Hilton Head Resort, we'll start at building four. Closest to the front security gate with on-site security team and the front office, there's a picnic and grilling area, tennis courts in front and inside the atrium, and a swimming pool, which is shaded most afternoons, so it's a great stop after a morning out in the sun at the beach. Next up is building three. Everybody plans for a sunny day at the beach to enjoy all the outdoor activities at Hilton Head Resort. But when the weather doesn't cooperate, Building 3 has you covered. I'm sorry. Here, the atrium and the pool area are totally enclosed. Only a few other local condo complexes on the island offer an indoor pool like this one, so this feature alone is a big plus. Indoor pool area, fitness room, and jogging track. Next up, building two with a sun deck, little badminton court, and a nice garden area. You also start to see some units in building two with ocean views from across the marsh. And we're right next door to the oceanfront resort community of Palmetto Dunes. So many of the condos here at Hilton Head Resort have golf views of number eight, nine, 10, and 11 at the acclaimed Robert Trent Jones course at Palmetto Dunes. The 10th hole is one of the only oceanfront greens on the whole island. You can also get a look at number 10 from Cocos. There is not a hole in the fence. I have never seen golfers pop over for a margarita at Cocos. But you think it might have happened once or twice? Building one. This is the building you've seen in the photos huge outdoor pool, restaurant, groceries, souvenirs, and bar at the seasonal poolside Island Grill and Deli. Many of the condos in Building One offer direct ocean views across the tidal marsh. And that's where we're heading next, over the boardwalk to Coco's Bar and Grill at the beach. Owners and guests can take the boardwalk and seasonal shuttle. The rest of us are gonna pay an entrance fee at the front security gate or walk in from the beach. Look for Beach Marker 94A. Coco's can be a little hard to find the first time, but they give you all kinds of navigational aids once you're there. It's a great beach bar. You can visit their website to see webcams, menu, and schedule. 
At the Hilton Head Resort, each building is a little different. No matter which building you stay in, you have access to all of it. It's a perennial vacation rental. And if you'd like to know the real estate picture, prices, fees, and what condos are available right now at the Hilton Head Resort, just call or text. I'm Chris Harrow with Keller Williams Realty. I hope this has been helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching, clicking, commenting, and subscribing. I'll see you on the beach.